everyone good morning <laughs> looking a hot mess I have a lot to do today but I'm gonna be sharing with you guys our huge grocery haul you guys know we've been going every week but uh, about once a month we do a huge big haul so this first haul you're gonna see is from Walmart and then I have to go to Sam's Club get the rest of the stuff that I need and then I'll share with you guys what I got at Sam's Club so Here's what I got at Walmart. Here is everything I got from Walmart. We are going to dive in and I'll share with you guys what I got and I'll share the total at the end. If I can remember, if not, I'll just put it down below. Starting off, we have two, four and a half pounds of chicken nuggets. Kids love these, gotta have them on hand. I like to have two bags at a time. We've got my pregnancy craving that is not healthy. <laughs> Rally's french fries, three big three pound bags I know it's not healthy but it's really good and I like it right now uh, a big I think this is a four pound bag of shredded hash browns we use these with breakfast casseroles and then like sides with meals and stuff so I had to get a big bag of that just works out getting a bigger bag instead of small bag five wait one two three four five five margarines I know this isn't the best for you but it's for baking here we are this is what we have two boxes of 60 eggs so 120 eggs we're gonna be doing some baking we go through eggs a lot we got some eggs uh three loaves of bread this is all gonna go in the freezer because you guys know i freeze my bread and i like to have it on hand i make a sandwich every day for savannah myself and zach so we go through bread a lot uh we've got these uh, rolls like these steak rolls. Zach's actually going to be, make, be making Philly cheesesteaks this weekend and so Philly cheesesteak sandwiches. That's why he got these. And then Hawaiian rolls. He's going to make something else so that's why he got Hawaiian rolls. I can't remember what he said he's going to make but we've got that. The steak of course for the Philly cheesesteaks. We have it right here. It is uh, not even a pound. It's 1061. That's crazy. Um, that's expensive. Anyways moving on. Heavy whipping cream, I got the bigger bottle because I have some crock pot recipes and stuff I wanna be using for this. Five gallons of 2% milk. That's right, I said five gallons. We've got one gallon of the almond unsweet vanilla milk. Love to mix my milks, so you guys know that. And the kids love milks, so that's why we have it. Marinara sauce, mayo for a dip Zach's making this weekend. Two things of ranch, two things of ketchup, the big ones. Go through ketchup a lot. Sharp cheddar for the dip he's making. We got mozzarella for, I think, something else he's making. Uh, and then provolone for the Philly cheesesteak sandwiches. Sausage, because we used one this week, so I need to replace it. Chopped onions. I've been wanting to have just some onions on hand in the freezer. Perfect. We've got broccoli, of course. And here we've got the big... 10 pound roll of ground beef and what I'll do is I'll split this into 10 separate sections freeze it and that way we have 10 different meals of one pound hamburger meat so I'm just going to leave that in here we've got chopped green onion this is for the dip Zach's making diced tomatoes with green chilies two corn for the dip I got three big cans of pumpkin puree because it's pumpkin puree season guys I'm gonna be making some cookies I got some recipes I want to make so I got the big cans so I'm prepared set to go big I think this is a five or ten pound bag of sugar baking I forgot to get the unbleached flour but I got the bleached flour and I think it's ten pound bag we got white rice, five pound bag, light brown sugar. We got the rice because we use this a lot for chicken fried rice. It's really good. I decided five pound bag was the easiest and best money wise decision. Two big bags of chocolate chips, baking of course. Blueberries, two pounds, no one pound, two ounces. I might get more at Sam's. Savannah's been really wanting blueberries with her lunches and she ate all of them from last weekend before school so and the kit and navy's been loving these too two red onions i have something i want to use these for two regular onions five cucumbers navy and i've been obsessed with cucumbers uh green pepper this is for um philly cheesesteak sandwiches and two bags of the tortilla chip dippers great value because chips are expensive and that's for the dip zach is making this is everything that I got from Walmart. I believe my total was like 240 something, I wanna say. I'm gonna put it down below for you guys. But now is the dreaded task 
of putting this all away <laughs> and then I get to load up and go to Sam's Club and do this all over again and share with you guys what I got from Sam's Club. But hopefully this lasts us a while. You know, certain things will last a long time, certain things will not. You know, obviously like eggs will last us a bit, milk, ketchup, you know, the flour, sugar, but then there's, you know, other things where it's like we'll have to go back, get some stuff. I know you guys don't see bananas or avocados. I'm gonna be getting that at Sam's Club because it's a better deal. You get a lot more for your money there. And strawberries, some other stuff I will be getting that you will see at Sam's Club. And chicken, forgot. Better deal of chicken at Sam's Club than at Walmart. Plus the chicken at Walmart isn't that good in my opinion. So we're gonna get it from Sam's. But now I gotta put all this away. I am back home from Sam's Club. Here's everything I got. Uh, you guys will see in my trunk. These are too heavy for me to carry in. So I got Zach's Diet Pepsi and water. It's gonna stay in here till he gets home. And that's what I got that I cannot carry in. Now let's go ahead, I'll show you what I got. Got more tortillas, needed lots of those. Hot dogs, that's what the kids requested. Avocados, we have more blueberries, another pound of blueberries. And I've got four pounds of strawberries because we've been loving strawberries and they were a good deal. Definitely get your strawberries from Sam's Club, highly recommend it. Maverick was good, so I got him Doritos. We got some potato chips. And Maverick insisted on trying these. He does not like them, but I got them for Zach. Uh, sweet and tangy barbecue flavor, so we've got those. Pizza rolls for the kids. More pudding for the kids. Uh, waffles. My probiotic that Zach and I take every day. Sour cream. Bananas. We got two bunches of this because, I mean, they're green, so it's good. We still have a couple of bananas left over at home, so this is perfect. Grape jelly. Need this for Savannah's lunches, and it's much cheaper to just buy it at Sam's. In bulk, we have chicken breasts. We have uh, two, wait, how much is it? Okay, I guess this says it's six pounds and it's $17.45. Got some breasts, what we'll do is we'll, you know, separate them so then, you know, they're not all frozen like this and divide it into meals. Cheez-Its, Savannah's been loving Cheez-Its and her lunch and for snack and the kids love them for a snack too. We have newborn diapers. I really like the members mark diapers, but I'm slowly buying like in each size diapers because I use cloth during the day for the babies, well, and for Navy, and then I use disposables at night or whenever we go somewhere. So that's why I have disposables. I have newborn cloth diapers I use, but I like using disposables at night. Find it helps them sleep a little bit longer, and then it's also easier when you're going places. You don't have to carry a wet bag with a diaper bag as well. And this is everything that I got from Sam's Club. My total, I believe, was maybe 190-ish. Um, I'll go ahead and put the total at the bottom. But I feel so much better that I went to Sam's Club, got what I needed. I feel so much better now that we have food in the house. Hopefully this lasts a while, fingers crossed, because this is just so expensive. Oh my gosh, our grocery, like the big thing used to be like $300 and now it's inched up to $400. And it's just, it's so crazy. And oh my gosh, I know we're all struggling with this, but it is just really hard. However, I'm really glad that I was able to go to Walmart and Sam's Club. Couldn't have gone to Sam's Club without my mother-in-law. She came along with us and helped with the kids, which was great. But yeah, now I get to put all this away, make lunch, and relax because I am exhausted from this morning. Really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys would like to see more, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.